Hello fellow builders, hello here, and today I'll show you something that is special to me. By the title you might already know it, what it is, but for the one that still may wonder, the video today will be about me doing a creep tour on one of the bases my clan owns in the PvP server that we are currently playing. So at the moment we are about 10 dedicated players with the expansion, the Frozen North, we decided to relocate. As soon as you enter uh, the base perimeter, you are inside this atrium and one of the clan members decided to make like a boxing ring here so you can take the frustrations out on each other. Cool idea and uh, we can have a laugh at the same time. This area is still being uh, developed but um, this is for now the access that we have to the catwalks above the atrium and above the entrances for the bases so this will be one of the towers or one of the platforms it's not a full tower yet we have some archers going on and recently we installed this alarm system so whenever someone raid us we can just run for our lives and save our loot on our left hand side will be the stairs to the second uh, platform and now i will cut to uh, already inside the base since uh, we are still playing and using this space I don't want to show so much of uh, how to get inside. I will also link uh, in the description another build I did on the same exact area but with a different layout. Uh, no, let's just close the drawbridge and um, continue our tour. So oh, this is Rika, uh, my clan leader. Let's just tease him a little bit. And uh, this is one of the temples we have inside the base. This is for Mitra to provide that amazing ambrosia. Let's close the doors. And we are now making our way to the living quarters. Uh, in the beginning, we used to have like an area where we all put our beds, but that isn't uh, shown to be very effective. So we decided to create this area with small huts where everybody they have their own beds and uh, you have a chest inside your hut where you can keep your precious loot. Uh, this is just a wheel of pain where we normally break our slaves. Now moving on, I'll show you the upper part uh, of the base. This is overwatching the entrance. Okay, let's now take the lift and go up and I'll show you more or less how things are at this point. So our goal here was to place some archers. We are still gathering this type of archers, the dogs of the desert, and uh, place them all around here. So if anyone breach, at least while we're trying to defend them using melee combat, we have our archers uh, providing uh, support cover from the above. Let's go back now and uh, I will show you the crafting area of the base. Hick is just staying over there. So we have a couple of members with OCD, so everything needs to be kind of straight and labeled. Uh, this is an, one of the crafting areas of the base. This is the second floor. You know, just regular stuff. Everybody uses it, but with a different layout perhaps. And for some reason, <laughs> the builder decided to create uh, the lobby or the gathering area top. Hey baby. Okay. Nah. She's just completely ignoring me. And uh, this is the chair of the leader. And now I'll show you uh, one of the oldest crafting areas uh, we had in the base. So we still use this as storage for uh, different random things but this is um, an area that we don't use uh, as much as we used in the past so we have one floor down two floors down oh an armor smith lost over there and uh, that was it guys this is one of our bases in a pvp server uh, we play on vanilla stats so everything is times one I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did leave a like and share the video on your social media. If you are new to the channel, subscribe for more content on Conan Exiles. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you all on the next one.
me that you love me 